What's up guys, good morning. Uh, I'm really digging this headband. Like I actually really like it. I kinda wanna get more. I've been wanting one for a long time. This one was like four bucks. I seen it, I liked it, I, I got it. But yeah, I think I'm gonna get some more because it keeps the hair on my face, I like it, and yeah, it looks a lot better putting it in a bun. And actually, I, I, was, I don't know if I vlogged it the other night, but I can put it in a bun better now. I'll show you in a little bit probably, I'll be wearing it. But with the headband on, it looks it actually looks better with the ponytail or bun, whatever you're gonna call it. I'm calling it the bun. So tomorrow's our last day in Portland. We have like pretty much all day though, because we're not flying out till uh, late in the afternoon or late at night or whatever. And then we're flying all night long uh, and get there super early in the morning. And then uh, we have a lot. We have a busy week ahead of us after that. I'm gonna be moving ramps and stuff like that, and getting ready for Jersey and probably driving to Jersey or Washington D.C. or maybe not Jersey. I don't. We really don't know what we're doing. We're winging it like usual. But yeah, anyways, I'm gonna enjoy Portland uh, for the last two days we got. This is where we've been staying, by the way. We didn't, I don't think we shared the room. Gray's painting her toenails. <laughs> uh, this is the room where we've been staying. A tempur mattress, which is really nice, but I'm kind of glad that I got to try one because it's not that I hate it, but it's not for me. Like, it's, I feel like it It doesn't hurt my back, but I don't know. I don't, I don't like the really sink in. Sore. Yeah. I guess Something. like tense kind of I feel yeah because it's like I'm just sinking too far into it it's comfortable but it's just like there's better beds for me right now I'm finishing up editing the vlog uh, I've been working down here and uh, I get to like look out and enjoy this view which is pretty awesome and look at this I don't know what I guess these are just like regular peaches I don't know if there's anything special done to them but they taste really freaking good uh, Darren's grandparents like where we're staying this is their house uh, it's not actually Darren's. We were kind of just like joking and stuff. Well, we said it wasn't Darren's house, but yeah, you get it. Anyway, uh, they're nice enough to let us stay here, which is really awesome. Like, it's a super nice house. And she's been like giving us breakfast every morning and stuff like that. Uh, so, yeah, really, really awesome. Really thankful we can stay here and have a freaking tempur pedic mattress. How cool is that? This view seriously does not get old. Like, I could look at this every time I walk by it or like even get a glimpse of this. Like, I almost have to stop and just like stare at it. Like, it's amazing. I like looking down on stuff like this because like you get to see it in perspective, I guess. It's just like you can see all the stuff happening down there. Like everybody's going on about their life, just going about their day, doing their stuff, their errands and going to work and all that. But you can step up here and you can just look at all of it happening and just, I don't know, it's amazing. Look at that. That is awesome. That's what I think of when I like see a view like this or I'm on a mountain or something. It's crazy. I would love to look at something like this every day. I really want to live in the mountains and have a nice view. See, that's the thing. I want to get a skate park, but I want to live in the mountains. I don't really want to get a, a warehouse in the mountains right now, or do I? I don't know what I want to do. I really don't, but I think I want to live in the mountains because I want to go snowboarding. And if I've got an indoor skate park, then I've got skateboarding. That sounds like a good idea. I, again, I'm just thinking out loud. All right, I'm gonna get some more peaches because they're freaking good. By the way, look at this freezer. How awesome is that? Or not, not freezer, but fridge. Like that's like a grocery store thing. So cool. Oh, these peaches are the best peaches I've ever had. What's up? Hey, dude. <laughs> peaches. Yeah, yeah, they're good. Oh, I'm so excited. More peaches. <laughs> this place is called Pizza Schmitza. <laughs> Makes me not want to eat there because of the name. But we are going to eat Panda Express. Gourmet Chinese food. I actually really like Panda Express. So good. At least all the times I've had it. Illuminati. Illuminati. Look at that. A triangle and an eye. I think they're watching. <laughs> they're always watching, even in Panda Express. Not bad branding for your security company. <laughs> they're watching always. <laughs> they're watching always. It smells so good in here. All right, I think I'm getting me some orange chicken, some steamed vegetables, and some kind of other chicken, probably. Or maybe broccoli and beef. Mm. This uh, honey walnut shrimp is really good. Darren got it. I was like, I'm going to try that. And I did. It was delicious. Fortune time. You will obtain your goal if you maintain your course. Skate park. I'm gonna get a skate park. <laughs> or you have a skate park. This fortune cookie could go into my mouth. That could be my goal. I think the goal Keep is to get goals, kids. another small box of orange chicken <laughs> for the road. <laughs> I'm gonna. We're about to go like hiking. <laughs> yeah, I know. We're going to a waterfall. You guys ready? It's like a valley, but it's 
instead of there being a valley, it's just water. It's so amazing. Just wait till we get to the uh, the overpass. Oh. We uh, leave the falls. Yeah. It's the craziest view of this valley. It's like mm -hmm. it's it's intense. Look at that. It's huge. More water. Yeah. All right, back to time lapse. Out. The big waterfall. Dude, that is awesome. Horsetail Falls. It's really chilly here too. You can feel like the mist coming in there. Right? What's well, cold here anyway? Yeah, but I can feel the water though. I can feel like a little bit of the you can feel the moisture in there. Fog down. Darren's got his phantom camera too. If you guys don't know what the phantom is, it's a camera that shoots super, super, super slow. -mo. That's what Darren channel is based around. How many frames a second is it? Uh, I can do 1,500 at 1080p. Good camera. Very expensive too. Again, Darren's rich. He has the big mansion, the huge camera. <laughs> sure, right. Yeah, uh-huh. Of there course There we I go. Am. I just realized that. Don't believe this sucker, dude. <laughs> nah, he's not. <laughs> you only see bits of Darren and every time it's like, he's got something expensive or his van. <laughs> <laughs> well, do you know, I'm actually just kind of like barely getting by artists, traveling around the world. and advanced. Starving artists. <laughs> Everybody's taking pictures and video and got their phones out. I want to swim in it. <laughs> At least fill the water. Oh, I know, I don't actually want to swim in it, but... That is really cold. Dude, that would be really good for you if you jumped in that. It's really good for your muscles. Oh, yeah. Like, when you're, well, that cold of water, your body goes into, like, as long as you don't do it where you go into shock, but it just pumps out so much stuff that, like, heals your body really fast because your body goes into almost shock. You know what I mean? I got you. It's so good for your body, especially with sore muscles. What I think about when I, like, see rocks and stuff like this and I'm just out in nature, like, when was it that these rocks right here got here? Because these are so big of rocks. Like, when was, when were they moved from either up there or back here to where they are? Like, was someone around watching it? Did it happen now? When is the next rock going to be here that's not here right now? They're big rocks. They didn't just appear here all of a sudden. They came from somewhere else. I'm going to try to walk on the rocks and not get my shoes away because it's the only shoes I have. This rock's wet. It's stable, though. Here we go, let's get the thumbnail for the video. Whoa. <laughs> Looking up about Lost Balance. Here's where the water kind of like flows. Down from there, through to here, under the little bridge. <laughs> I wasn't vlogging, but oh my God, I stepped on a rock and it just like wobbled everywhere. I could have just got so soaked. I left the GoPro on the water <laughs> to do that little time lapse of the water and then on the way back I thought I was at the, the edge of the ground and I stepped right in the water. Got my shoe all wet inside. I, I don't know what I was thinking. I was just I was looking at the rocks and then I looked up at them or something. I, I wasn't paying attention. I stepped in the water. I'm an idiot. <laughs> Sorry though, I didn't get that wood. There's one. Beautiful, right? Beautiful. It's just so beautiful. It has nothing to do with what we're doing, but if you want to see what Darren's camera can do in action, here's two skate clips of me at the park the other day. Uh, it's filming in slow-mo that he shot, so yeah. Amazing, right? Yeah. It's like super, super, super slow. That's I want to awesome. get, get, I want to get a wide angle side of you on that rock. All right. With the, uh, I gotta switch out one. I'm gonna like hop out onto the rocks. Film some cool slow mo stuff. 
So we've pretty much just like been playing around the water, throwing rocks, oh my God, and like shooting everything in slow mo. This camera is amazing. We threw a rock and like captured the splash. Darren's got the camera. I'm gonna try to hit this rock over here. Tell me when you're ready. Alright. Too far? Yeah, too far. We found another rock. <laughs> Just like pulling him out of the dirt. Oh, that's a little one. All right, step number two. Too far again, right? Yeah. Dang it. I suck. Gray's gonna try. Right there. No, no. See there's this rock? Yeah. There's one, two, and then there's a third rock right there. Okay, so close. Yeah. Yeah, like on that. Right on that rock. Okay. I couldn't hit it. I was, I was throwing it too far. See if I can do it. <laughs> I can't. My hair's getting so frizzy from the mist. Get it, Gray. Get it. Get it. Good. Oh, where did I miss it? number four. <laughs> Good. Okay. Perfect. I'm stupid, but I took my shoes off. And I'm gonna try to get in the water a little bit. Oh, that's cold. This would be good for my ankle. This is unbelievably cold, just so you know. Oh, all right, there we go. My ankle's gonna sit in there for a minute. <laughs> my ankle is still swollen a little bit, and it's got like a really tough spot on it. Uh, like, I guess, scarred skin under there. Not scarred skin, I don't know, scarred tissue or whatever. And yeah, it's still a little bit swollen from when I hit it the last day I was in LA. Probably need to get it checked doesn't really bother me that much but it's still like swollen so that that's kind of a problem not whatsoever am I getting used to this <laughs> so cold I can still wiggle my toes though <laughs> so I'm good so Darren is taking us to the next waterfall this one is Motonama Motonama Falls Columbia River George Gorge <laughs> National uh, Scenic Area this one is a lot bigger look at that we're gonna walk up to it. This food smells so good. And look at this, they've got a sign on it because there's bees everywhere. It says, we know there are bees. In our case, <laughs> we are bee friendly. <laughs> we are They're bee everywhere. friendly. That's hilarious. Bee. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Little chipmunks. Getting so close to us. Hehehehe. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so he set a bunch of nuts right there. He came really close. <laughs> right, so here's the waterfall. It's actually two. One here is 69 feet. There's another one up there, which I guess there's a pool and you can see it from the bridge. Uh, I don't know how many, it's like 400 something feet. Great getting them angles. And this one's big. I was sending pictures right as photo of me. Well, you know some tricks too, even. Well, I'm not. Uh, that looks more impressive than my stuff. That's a meat. Oh, I got sick. You could do it with me. Oh, nice. Uh. There it is. <laughs> we're walking up to the top bridge now, up the little trail. I think we're already getting up high. You can see the water out there now. Big like thing to catch rocks falling. Big branches and stuff. I wonder how strong that is. Oh look, there's two fences. That's to catch some big stuff. Two fences and then a net. I love the moss on these trees. Right? It makes it look like crazy. It's like all over the trees too. Everywhere. We're not on this side. Yeah, don't put my butt again, quit. Wow. Look at all the pennies. <laughs> Change. It's awesome. Aw, oh, dude, if that was deep, can you imagine jumping off this? Great. Would you jump off this if it was deep? No. Down to there? What? I would do no. that in a second. No, I know you could. Yeah, I would. Oh my god, that'd be awesome. That would be an adrenaline rush. Jumping right out into there, that'd be so fun. Darren's getting some slow clips. <laughs> Alright, that's the top 
up, I'm assuming. Right there. Yep. <laughs> there it is. We just seen the view. I got a little glimpse of it. Amazing. Blind it already. We are way up in the mountains right now. Look at that. But I can't fix it. God, that's amazing. This is crazy. See all out there where the sun's setting. It's like a 180 degree view. Yeah, it's pretty nice. <laughs> you can't see back this way. But there is a lot of mountains. Beautiful. Telescope. I think you have to pay. It's 50 cents. Do we have 50 cents in the bag? I have some in my pocket in my book bag. <laughs> Can you see? <laughs> That's crazy. POV. You see the rays coming down through the clouds. Yeah, I put my GoPro up to it. Kind of see. Ah, oh, this isn't as good because the road. I didn't know there was a road there. Look, you can't hear it, or you can hear it, then you can't hear it. Like, you back up, you don't even know there's a road down there. Look how much louder it is right here. Huh. Yeah. I got some rocks from the first waterfall we went to. I like three or four, and I think there's one I'm gonna like, I get an engrave like Portland, Oregon, or something like that uh, for my grandma. Like, she like, not really collects rocks, but uh, she's got a ton of rocks like at her house, uh, like stacked and stuff like that. So I figured it'd be cool to take her one from Portland. At a waterfall. Oh yeah. We're at Applebee's. We just ordered some food and here's our appetizers. We got some wings, spinach archo dip. Darren's waiting on his, he got the sampler. He's gonna try out a bunch of stuff. And uh, I'm replying to some comments on yesterday's vlog. So uh, yeah, if you guys want to, leave some comments down below on this vlog and I'll try to reply to a bunch of you guys down there. All right, now we're at Walmart. They have those here <laughs> in Portland. We're back at home, guys. <laughs> no, we're not. It's uh, not. So we're actually, I think there's a red box here. We're going to go to, oh yeah, there, there it is. We're going to the red box. We're going to get the imitation game due to Gray's recommendation. She's wanting to watch it. We're going to watch a movie in the big theater tonight. We're finally doing it. We've been saying we're pretty much every night we've said we're going to do it. We're going to watch this movie tonight, finally. And then we end up not doing it. We're like, oh, do we want to watch a movie? And no, we're like, nah. Like we get to the back of the place and then these two are like, I'm so tired. <laughs> if I watch a movie, I'm going to fall asleep. There's no way I'm making it through this movie. I already know that, but at least Gary will. <laughs> oh, oh, you turn on a movie with him in it? I'll watch it. Oh my god. <laughs> Benedict, whatever his name is. Cumber something. Cumberbatch. <laughs> Benedict Cumberbatch. He's an amazing man. <laughs> he is. Uh, you haven't seen Interstellar yet? No. You're is it good? You're obsessed with like the universe stuff. <laughs> How have you not seen Interstellar? Interstellar. Should I watch it? Yeah, you absolutely need to watch Interstellar. I think Chris told me to watch it. I don't know. It you're just didn't seem. Who, it didn't seem interesting to me. You're the one who's constantly obsessing over like amazing technology. I don't know. And, like, yeah. I haven't seen enough trailers of it. I've seen like one trailer where they're like floating in space. That's it. Yeah, you need to watch I'm gonna win an Adventure Time thing right here for 50 cents because I randomly had 50 cents in my pocket, and that's how much of the chain is. So 50 cents. Here we go. See if we win an Adventure Time. I think that's what I'm going for. I could get a minion, but who likes minions? A lot of people do, actually. The camera's about to die, I gotta hurry. All right, are we lined up, are we lined up? No, we're not, these things are rigged. I'm not gonna win. Let's try it. Oh, 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 oh. You. That's waste of 50 cent. Z imitation game. Ah. Sorry, guys. Look at how wonderful of a man that is. And Karen Knightley's in it. All right, we've we've narrowed it down to Chappie, possibly, or what is the other one? This one, X Machina. <laughs> That's how Gray said it. Because I think Machinima. Machinima. I know, it's like Machinima. Do We're going for X Machina. Does it matter? It's about AI, artificial intelligence. It's R-rated. No, 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 no. No, no, we can't watch it. We can't. Here we go. <laughs> it's finally time. This whole theater to ourselves. <laughs> <laughs> this is gonna be awesome. Made me a smoothie. Now we're gonna watch a movie. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> well, how'd you like the movie? <laughs>
I didn't even watch it. I went asleep. Like, he fell straight asleep the second it turned on. Like three minutes, I was asleep. I really loved it. It was a great movie. And knowing you, you absolutely love it. Darren, what was your thought? That was really well done. Sure. Out of ten, what would you give? I'd probably give it like a solid eight. Yeah, I'd probably say about an eight too. Huh. Ten out of ten. <laughs> so ten out of ten. I know. I'm kidding. Let's go. Let's go sleep now. Yep. All right, guys. I didn't end the vlog. Thank you for watching. Click the like button down below if you enjoyed it. Subscribe for new vlogs Monday through Friday. See you guys tomorrow. Peace. Oh, you're so sleepy. Your eyes are so red because you're so tired. I'm so tired. Peace.